Hey guys, this is Aaron Tebow from Pete's RV Center in South Burlington, Vermont. Today I want to take you through the 2016 White Hawk 25 BHS. Let me just back up for you here. For those of you who don't know, the White Hawk is made by Jayco. Jayco is a very popular brand, mainly because they go over the top in making a strong, sturdy camper. You know, if you haven't heard, they have a two-year warranty. Two years. The reason they do this is because they have things like vacuum bonded siding, um, laminated walls, as well as magnum truss roofing and things like that. And I'm, I'll show you a little bit more about that when we get inside. But if you really want to see why you should buy a Jayco, check out my other video. It's all about why and how Jayco makes the perfect camper for things you can't see with your eyes. Today we're going to go through a little bit of a physical stuff, starting from the front here. You can see right off the start, power tongue jack. You know, for those of you who have bad backs or, you know, you're doing this alone, up and down by push of a button is literally a lifesaver. As well as you have a front docking light right there, very sharp, very helpful. Right behind that, you have your LP, your propane tank cover. This is actually protecting your propane units from, uh, you know, anything from the elements, whether it's rust, water damage, snow, anything you have under here, there's a quick cover to check your gauge and things like that. It'll just pop open. Uh, right behind here, you're going to see I have a battery hooked in so we can see everything with lights and all that. Um, you do have a second spot for another battery. This is for if you're dry camping a lot. You can really extend your camping time without having to go in. You see nice docking lights. You got a front cap right here. It's three quarters. It's a nice mold uh, cap right on here. As well as a diamond rock guard. I don't know if you can see. There we go. This is so if anything kicks off from under your truck. It's going to deflect right off and not actually damage the nice laminated front right there. All right, let's move down the side here. First thing you're going to notice is a massive storage door. Look at the storage in this guy. It goes all the way through to the other side. We have pass through, and I'll show you on the other side. You actually have a slot for a um, a table, and uh, it's a very unique thing that Whitehawks do. And it's pretty cool. You also see an outlet there. If you want to, you know, put in. I don't know anything you want really as well as LED light right there to give you some night in the light all right let's see actually let me show you that storage part from the other side while we're over here here's your other door there's a slot where your table will slide in for you it's a really nice unique feature that they have while we're on the side you can't see many frameless tinted windows this is perfect for uh, many reasons. One, they don't leak as much, as well as, you know, it's giving you privacy with the tinted windows. In hot summer days, that heat's not gonna go right in. It's gonna deteriorate some of that, and uh, actually save the fabrics inside from weathering from the sun. So, it's a great thing to have. There's some more tinted windows. All right, let me show you the powered awning with LED light strip. I had it just pulled out a few feet here just to show you. Um, it will extend, obviously, further looks sharp looks great you know that white siding i think looks awesome on a camper right here you have your Furion speakers this is so you can listen to some music outside under the awning as well as a tv bracket if you want you can mount a tv there so you have cable hook up here as well as power outlets and you can use those power outlets for really anything you want moving down you're actually going to see the outside kitchen you have a nice small refrigerator a two burner cooktop, shelves, and actually a huge space that you can store, you know, anything you want for outside. It could be food, could be utilities, pots, pans, anything you want. Moving down the back here, you're going to see a ladder, fully walkable roof up there. See in this frame, see that it's actually um, vaulted. So any rain or water or debris is going to slide off the side instead of sticking up up there. I'll show you from the inside what it looks like as well spare tire black tank flush huge 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 for any of you that's had to do this without it it just makes life easier um, flushes out the tank so there's nothing stuck or debris or anything like that <laughs> here's a little curveball there's a back door that goes right into the bathroom on this model you don't see that on many models at all i'll show you what it looks like when we get inside it's a rear bath right next to the bunks looks awesome helps for kids who are dirty and you don't want to you know truck them through with all the mud on their feet utility shower or you can wash them out here it's good also because you have your black tank flush right here or your black tank valve sorry um, you can rinse off dirty hoses or anything like that all right now let's swing around let's head inside 
give you a quick showing in there. Um, oh, here we go. Three steps. Look how low to the ground we are. No spaceman jumps just to get up uh, into the unit. Okay, here we go. So here's a quick little showing, and then we'll dig into it a little deeper. Here's your dinette. That table's gonna go down. It actually collapses so you can bring it outside as well. It's not on the pedestals, so you have to keep it in here. You can bring that outside. It also goes down onto these little slots right here so you can sleep extra people. You know, maybe your uh, your kids bring their friends, and they need a spot to stay. Both sides, you have huge storage in here, and they actually give you bins. So you can, you'll load your stuff in, slide in, without having to reach all the way in there. It's much easier, very convenient. Actually, while we're at it, here's some of the things the White Hawk has. Um, you can pause the video if you want to see things I didn't touch upon. Um, actually, your wheels, they're actually spread wide axles so that, you know, um, it's smoother ride. Not so, you know, bumpy from the back. So if you're behind the wheel, you feel safe and sound. Steel wheel wells as well. So if they you blow a tire for any reason, it's actually going to be uh, resistant and it doesn't do any damage in the inside of your hull. All right. Here's a pantry or hang your clothes. I have you not. Um, move to the bathroom. This is where I was talking about with the door. You can see it right off. A little back entry in here, a little secret door. Toilet. Tubs around here. Huge tub for growing families. You can wash them off if you need be. Medicine cabinet with actual cabinet, not just the glass. How you guys doing? Sink, more storage underneath here. All right, let's move on. Do, 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 do. Here's the main part of why you're getting one like this, your bunk beds. Denver mattress, very sturdy. Look how thick they are here. Lots of support for your kids. A little table right there, as well as an outlet if they need to charge anything. Maybe, you know, they're watching a movie on a tablet or something. And then identical down below. Same mattress, same huge double over double size beds for if they're growing or maybe you fit their friends in there as well. Doesn't matter, it's up to you. Island sink, very sharp, nice, huge, huge, huge sink. Look at the size of this guy. Pots, pans, not a problem. You have high rise sink, so you can get in there, clean anything you need. You have storage on three separate spots on this guy. Third one being over there. All right, now let's get a little bit into the kitchen area. You have a six cubic foot um, electric and gas. It's got the auto switch on it. It's by Norcold. They make an amazing fridge and freezer. You know, say you're plugging in electricity, all of a sudden it goes out for some reason. That gas is going to kick in. It's going to save all the stuff in your fridge so you don't lose all that food and precious stuff. More drawers, microwave, residential, has the um, popcorn button as we always like to say. Do anything you want. Three burner, cook stove, as well as oven down below. You have top and more storage in here with actually another outlet. It's hard to see, sorry, it's dark in there. All right, entertainment center. Two storages up below. This one's actually got hangers on it, as well as it's your main control panel. Everything you need is right here. Light switches, um, your awning, your slides, your tanks. You can see how full everything is. All empty, obviously, right now. Brand new model. Important thing to note about this one, it's a Furion on TV. Very large. Actually, spins around to the other side. So if you want to uh, watch it from inside which I'll show you in a second you can do that you don't need to buy two TVs you just need the one that comes with it there's a bracket right there from outside yeah, let's swing in here first thing I know you can see that green light it's a USB charging station it's perfect it charges your phones tablets as well as you have an actual outlet right there in your nightstand open this up huge huge storage it's mirrored you have the same thing on both sides um, you actually have, probably can't see it, 
in the corner there, there's even more space to store things. It's just tucked away for like your phones and things like that when you're sleeping. Close this. So right now you have a mirror right here, but this is gonna switch and become your TV if you want it to. And then you'll have the mirror on the other side. Um, that's something you can always do whenever you like. Uh, let's see. Co hangers right there. Other than that, I think we got everything. Uh, it's a great model, great buy for the price. Uh, smooth laminated sides. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. My name's Aaron again. You can call us at Pete's RV Center. We'd be more than happy to help you with anything you need. And, uh, you know, this is Jayco made. This is the top stuff right here. So if you're looking to buy a camper, I suggest looking into Jayco. Have a good day, guys.